guys. We are going to learn about commands today. Now, commands are sentences that tell you what to do. So, the reason I have drawn well, a pizza, it's meant to be a pizza, and a knife, is because I want you to think back to when we did instructions on how to make our yummy, delicious pizzas. Now, we used commands, instructions to make that in Miss you just lost her words. Let me start again. To make the pizza. So, commands use bossy verbs and the special word for bossy verbs is imperative verbs and they tell you what to do. For example, we got the knife so that could be cut. It could be slice. It could be chop. So these are telling us what to do. So let's have a look at an example. Gonna move my book down. Okay, so I'm gonna say, bow down to your king. So bow is our imperative verb. It is our bossy verb. So for bow, we need a capital letter because of the beginning of our sentence. So capital B. We need the owl sound, bow down to your king. Full stop. So, bow here is our imperative verb, our bossy verb. Okay, let's do another one. I think you can still see. So, p -p -ick. pick up that glass. So, pick is the imperative verb. Pick is the bossy verb. Let's have one more. So, just going to move my book down so you can see. Um, have, again, capital letter. Please pull. Remember, a lowercase p sits on the line because it's a descender. Please pull the cord. Full stop. So this time, my imperative verb is not at the beginning of the sentence. So where could it be? Please pull the cord. That's right. Pull is our imperative verb, our bossy verb. All right, guys, have fun commanding, and I shall see you in the next video. Bye.